Guaczilla 1.0 was five years ago. One, two, three, four, five. Five years ago. Do you feel old yet? Well, I guess what they say is true then. Time flies when you're having fun. <laughs> Shut the hell up, bitch. All right, I'll stop, I'll stop the time. No, but seriously, what's actually changed in the last five years? Oh, I don't know. Everything. Well, I guess for starters, we're all probably legal adults now. Or even crazier, there's probably an entire generation of YouTube kids who haven't even seen Guaxilla 1.0 or know what Team 10 was, is, was. Was. You, you guys know what I'm talking. Hey, yo, oh, 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 oh. Show us the car sorry. Ready. Okay, all right, I'll make this fast. The only point I'm trying to make right now is pretty much summed up in this Pinterest quote that I found in less than two seconds after literally Google searching "life goes by too fast" quotes. Life goes by faster than you think it does, for real. Real son, we keep it real. Is Tanner ever gonna show up? He's always freaking late. Dude, I know, right? This guy's always taking his time. Wheels this, what's it gonna look like? Reveal tomorrow. I mean, people just wanna see the car. Let's just get on with this freaking intro. I don't really know what to say. Uh, we're we're doing this. It. We're here. This is time for the Guaxilla 3.0 reveal. It's <laughs> just like a knock on it. Yeah. Is that a good way to do it? Is that cheesy? Should I just, oh, yeah, I just knock on it. All right, I'm just gonna knock on it. Some, yeah, that's, that's a good one, yeah. Yo, what? Oh, oh. Yo, open it. Dude. What are they doing? Raise the gate, bro. Open the gate. Yep. Evan, move your foot, dude. Evan! Shit. Dude, take it off the door. Just like the Pope, I've been talking to ghosts. The Holy Spirit always makes an appearance. He said, Can I help you write one of your lips? What's that fucking lip theory? He said that the difference between us is easy to see. I looked up at him and said, What you mean? He said that the difference between us is easy to see. Cause I pray on you while y'all pray for me. It looked like he came out of hell with that heat. I said that was sweet, but I bet on my life I can have to beat. He said that you wanna put life on a beat. I told him that he was a spirit and I was a beast. This rip is simple, it's easy to me. It's like ABC, so I put my life on the line. Cause that's how an alphabet put some respect on the power that I possess. Makes it Three P's like an alchemist Nothing I say is an accident I don't be babbling I just be baffling I just start battling It's like Babylon Here it is Guaxilla 3.0 Round of a No, I'm not gonna do that Here it is guys Five years later A lot's changed Before After Before After Before After Look at this thing It's completely different Wide body New wheels Fully built engine Trans you guys have heard about all that in the Guaxilla 2.0 reveal. Before I go over all of the new stuff we did for this video, I feel like it's only right I do a small history lesson on Guaxilla over the last five years and re-update you guys on all the parts Guaxilla 2.0 has. But before that, I gotta tell you, for the only time this entire year, the T-Fox brand site is 40% off for Black Friday. This is the best time to go Christmas shopping. We have Hot Wheel mystery boxes, we have a ton of stuff restocked, and we even dropped a limited supply brand new line for the Guaxilla and Lambo reveal. This stuff, again guys, this stuff is super limited. We got really cool stickers. We got some sick different apparel on the website right now. We even have these really cool jet tags, which are the best ones we've ever made. Double-sided, we got the green on that side, we got the blue on that side, which you can't see because there's a thing right there. Look at this shirt, man. This stuff is extremely limited supply. It's only for the Guaxilla 3.0. Seriously, I would get on that. This stuff is selling out like right now, so. Where do we even begin with this thing, man? So five years ago, we bought the GTR from a Chula Vista Nissan dealership. We picked the car up, took it to SD Wrap, somehow created Guaxilla 1.0 with SD Wrap, named by TJ Hunt. Started an absolute era, guys. From then, I thought, well, I have to one-up Guaxilla 1.0. I didn't know how to do that. You know, I was 16, 17. We wide body this thing, man. We put a one of one Liberty Walk Type 2 wide body kit completely molded. You heard me say that in the last reveal video. Still the only one in the entire world that is molded. These are the Guaxilla 2.0 wheels. We just had the barrel repainted in this beautiful Ferrari finish called Oro, which I learned means gold. 
in Italian. Uh, 2M did the work on this. They are the same people that molded the Liberty Walk kit. I can't forget about these. Michelin, Michelin is family. I got the Pilot Sport Cup 2s on right now. Best tires in the game. Michelin, I love you guys. Man, this is the part that uh, a lot of people care about. We still got the IPE exhaust. It's fully titanium, fully straight piped. The is loud, right? She's loud. We got the three-way club sports with some swift springs. And what that means is the car's not on bags. It has this small lift. And then this would be its ride height. You guys already knew that. That's part of Glockzilla 2.0. Um, under the hood, we got the Alpha X. That basically means it's faster than an Alpha 9. This is uh, the fastest Alpha 9 in the entire United States. It's about 1100, 1100 to the crank. In order to have that much power, you gotta rebuild the trans. We got the Shep trans and then the beautiful interior. We got our beautiful fire extinguisher, our half cage back there. We got these beautiful Recaro seats. They actually recline, they're not buckets. I was gonna get carbon buckets for this car just because carbon bucket seats, but surprisingly, those are really uncomfortable. They don't recline and you don't want them in a daily. So Recaro gave us these a while ago and they're amazing. <laughs> we even got all the uh, beautiful carbon fiber re-glossed in here. Uh, some of you guys might not know that. The stitching in here has all been redone to kind of match the green on the outside. This is the Guaxilla 2.0 interior. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but man, that's the, that's the, you know, we didn't change anything in there. The main thing for Guaxilla 3.0 that we changed was the new wrap, the new wheels. I'm gonna cut over to the boys at Auto Armor and Pure Design so they can give you a rundown what they were thinking on how they designed the car. This is the man, the myth, the legend right here, Evan, owner of Auto Armor. Final impressions? Came out uh, uh, better than we expected. The design was uh, uh, really cool. I hope everybody likes it. What do you oh think? Oh my God, bro. I think this is the best version of Guaxilla we've ever had. It's like the most mature, the most exciting, it's the most sleek. I gotta ask you, what was your thought process choosing this design? Like, how do, how do you guys kind of come up with that? Well, when we first talked, we uh, talked about doing like kind of like a yin and yang, like yeah. basically matchy uh, uh, thing. We wanted something simple, but uh, something mature and, yeah. and something that uh, everybody would uh, like. Hopefully we, we nailed it. Dude, I think we did. The biggest thing I remember we were talking about is we didn't want to go like too overboard on the design. Coming from the last wrap with like the fade, it's really hard to kind of one-up that with like a shape design. No, that one's so, it. That, I mean, that that uh, design will be always iconic. Yeah. And, and everybody will still remember that one. And, yeah. And uh, I think uh, this is a nice compliment uh, to that. It's great that a nose tech gave us uh, this Dude. color. This color is one of my favorites. For real. Day. It's pretty dope. So overall, man, you think it came together nice? Uh, I think it came together awesome. I think I can't wait for people's reactions. Yeah. Like at, at shows and, and car shows. I uh, can't a big wait thing. for people to see this video. It's gonna be awesome. Dude, when is the next Auto Armor car show? Well, we have a toy drive on the 5th of December. 5th of December. If you guys want to see. Bring toys. It's for a really good cause. It's gonna be a, a lot of cool cars. So, December 5th, what time? Just check on our Instagram. Check on Instagram. And uh, there's more details to, to follow. Dude, amazing. Guaxilla 3.0 just got shown and you guys already have a chance to come see it. So the first car show Guaxilla is gonna be at December 5th, Toy Drive at Auto Armor. You heard it here. Check the Instagram to get all the details, guys. But I gotta clean this thing down. She's been, uh, she's been a little dusty getting the wheels painted. Evan, I gotta say, man, thank you guys for all the hospitality with the cars. The Lambo, we're about to put those wheels on. You, got, you guys are seeing both cars in this video. But done. It's done, man. It's no done. Way. All right, look. Go ahead. Get out of here, dude. It's together. Oh. This is the man's opinion that matters. Oh, this is the man that matters right here. With the green. Oh, I'm, oh. Shoot. No, you can curse. That looks so. 
Fuck. You can kind of see almost like gold in there too. Yeah. In the, it, in the green. It's a Ferrari Dude, color. So sick. It's called Oro. It means gold That's in Italian. Sick. I just learned that today. I'm actually glad we didn't get the wheels we were supposed to get. I mean, from the get, I was like, let's just do those barrels. No. Right? So it all worked so out. Good, yeah. This is the man behind Guaxilla in the beginning. So is it is it Guaxilla approved? Oh, that's Guaxilla approved for sure. You heard Ooh. it here first, ladies and gentlemen. It was a wait, but it was worth it. it was so dude. worth it. Man. It was so worth it. We You're don't we so don't miss sick. it, but we had to bring in Medi because man, this guy is the history of Guaxilla. He came up with Guaxilla One because we stole that color off of your car. Yep. And then Guaxilla 2.0, we stole off of your surfboard. The surfboard. <laughs> <laughs> Guaxilla 3.0, Medi had to be involved. So, um, guys, major shout out to Pure Design SD. I gotta make that clear. They both worked on these builds. It wouldn't have been the same thing if it wasn't the same people. Exactly. You know. She knows, the car knows. The car knows, it has a piece of, it has really has a piece of you it knows, inside yeah. of it, I'm sure. You spend a lot of lonely nights oh, in Oh, literally, car. yeah, there's yeah. probably some skin. And <laughs> it's it it. different seeing it all like 100%, because we've seen so many stages. Yeah. So much waiting, but dude, oh, seeing it all together. It's, it's also unreal. weird with the wait period, you know, like, yeah. like oh. But then it's done, so we're Then it, yeah. I think it turned out amazing. It exceeded my expectations tenfold. All right, Medi, I do. I gotta ask a couple questions. Yeah. For you going into designing Guaxilla 3.0, mm -hmm. what was like? What was in your headspace? What were you thinking? What were you going for overall? So, what'd you want big, out? Of it? A big part of it with all three or the two previous versions, obviously the Guaxilla, the green. We needed something that kind of brought that in. And me personally, I'm just I love the brushed metal finishes, and we obviously did that on the first version. So pretty much with this version, kind of bringing both of those and integrating it together, which was honestly kind of. Like, how do we do that? But luckily, the Nozatech wrap, I mean, that's some like new super gloss. They're almost two complete opposite materials. Yeah. But having them kind of like flow into each other. And this is a Nozatech's Mama Green. As soon as I was flipping through the color book, I'm like, that's the gloss. That's the color green right there. My part about that, I like how the, the we flop the colors. Exactly. More business. That's what was cool because the, the, the last one, the whole back end was black. Whereas this one, you can tell, is way more aggressive with all the black being up front. Yeah. So we kind of flipped that, used different materials, and I mean, the end product is, I'm stoked. I think you're stoked. Dude. I think they're gonna be stoked. 100%. So, I mean, so you definitely had the little details in mind. Yeah. I, I don't think people actually realize how much of the design is on Auto Armor and Pure Design rather than me. People probably think I have like a way heavier say. I'm good at YouTube, like I make videos. That's my job. These guys are professionals. That's what they do, they design. Pretty much all of the car reveals we've ever done. Most of it is really just trusting these guys because they're professionals and this is what they do as their profession. And it never misses. Well, we pretty much have gotten all the shots we've needed today. Really? Yeah, which is surprising. This is definitely the fastest car I've ever been. Man, we've gone like two miles an hour. <laughs> so who are you, bro? Um, Cameron's cousin. Cameron's him, cousin. Like, uh, grew up together. He came down to get a little early sneak peek of the GTR. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's freeway time, guys. We're gonna get freeway rollers. His first reaction to a little bit of speed in the GTR. You gotta really wait till you have enough space to floor it because this thing is too fast. Happy day, sad day. It's a happy day, sad day, because the GTR is leaving. We don't like when the GTR leaves, but it's for good reason. Which one do you guys want? <laughs> I'm calling GTR. You yeah. want the GTR? I want V3 on the GTR. We have design options already. Oh! Not the colors. This is a random update. These guys at Auto Armor are working so fast. I can't believe this. It's been like a week. I just can't believe this. I just can't believe this. This is about to look hard, bro. Which one you like better? GTR? It's just okay. it's all day. Which one you like better? GTR. GTR? Ooh, okay. GTR. 
Well, good, because that reveal's coming first. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you're the man behind both of these cars, so which one is your favorite? No, I mean, like, it's just good vibes. Yeah. But, like, it's I'm gonna have to go with the classic. The GTR? Mm -hmm. The GTR. the GTR guys, oh, you're gonna like it. So, yeah. Medi just asked what I think about it. I'm not just saying this for the video. This is the best version. Yes. This is the best version. Pulling up at 2M Auto Works right now. David's already getting the wheels put on. Oh, this looks so good. Well, here they are, ladies and gentlemen. The original Vossen wheels repainted. <laughs> she twerking. <laughs> she got a fat ass. Get it this way, get it this way. Oh my god. David, this is Dude, it looks so good. Gold really goes well. It I matches the, the green so yeah. well. Oh I my like god. It. Yeah, I need to take some photos of this before we dip. Thank you so much, David. Seriously, <laughs> dude. That's my girlfriend. That's my girlfriend. the video do not forget that the T Fox brand Black Friday sale is 40% off the entire store and we even got some brand new apparel this is the Guaxilla 3.0 even got a little sneak peek of the Lambo on there for you guys uh, new stickers new hats entire new garage line everything 40% off so get on that this is the best time to go Christmas shopping and in honor of Guaxilla 3.0 just so you guys could go see all the behind the scenes footage of the GTR being built. All the stuff I was not able to show in this video is on the No Fox Club. And if you use the code GUAC, you're gonna get $1 your first month on the No Fox Club. For only $1, you get access to all the giveaways, all the feed posts, all the exclusive videos, the entire build process of this, and so much more. So make sure you guys check that out and use code GUAC for $1 your first month on the No Fox Club. And get your Christmas shopping on, guys. T Fox brand's hot right now. Everything's 40% off. I love y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Last thing, uh, for real, what I said in the beginning, uh, life goes by a lot faster than you think it does. So make sure you're doing what makes you happy. Make sure you're doing things you love. And most importantly, you're having a good time while you're doing it. Peace. Funny, you just see chuck, 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 GTR, GTR out of nowhere. <laughs>